Welcome everybody, D here, and today we're going to be talking about a really cool subject I like to call video games, because that's what I do. I talk about video games and do video game reviews. You guys that have watched my channel know what I do. So, um, today's going to be kind of a depressing topic, I guess. I don't really know what you call it. But today we're going to be talking about uh, what I would do if I created video games. Now, um, the reason I really want to talk about this is because I feel like the industry for video games is going downhill, and I want to, you know, try to not say, Oh, this game sucks, because it's stupid, because it's, it's just stupid, you know, there's a lot of those stupid gamers out there that just take a pretty good looking game and then trash it, and, um, you know, sometimes I feel like the company did try actually actually tried to put a lot of work into the game um you know instead of just like saying oh yeah we're just gonna make this real quick and throw it right at you because you know there's a lot of companies that do that but then you have those companies that do actually try to produce good games so um for example today i was looking up uh some videos on youtube and i decided to watch a video on uh i think it was angry joe playing um far cry primal and uh that game looks really interesting to me um now i was looking down in the comments and everybody was saying oh it's just a reskin of the previous far cry games it's so stupid looking uh you know i kind of felt the same way it does kind of look similar to the previous far cries but at least they're kind of gonna try to something new you know i've never seen a game like this before being kind of a primal state you know i've never seen like cavemen fight each other i mean yeah we had turok and stuff but i don't even want to talk about turok evolution um i've never heard of any other turok game to fight turok evolution and that was garbage in my opinion mainly because it just felt so real bland to me and that's just my own opinion i'm not trying to say that's the worst game ever hey uh, i might have said that in the video but i don't know i i wasn't feeling good that day either i was also really sick and I was just not thinking clearly. Um, I'm pretty sure that game is really great. I just gotta play it more and actually sit down and play it. Um, so, um, yeah, so yeah, I just, this whole just dumb gamers trashing pretty good looking games is kind of getting on my nerves. Now, when it comes to Call of Duty, you could trash a shit out of that. I don't give a damn because those motherfuckers have been producing games like rabbits producing children and they seem to all be the same damn thing you know there's no you're producing a bunch of white bunnies but there's no black bunnies coming out of mama bunnies so you know it's just, it's just like the same freaking thing over and over again this is terrible um i don't know why i decided to use rabbits and bunnies for uh example but whatever anyways so um if i was in the gaming industry i would try to make something that's never been done before and I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people that have said that because it's what we want It's what we want to do. It's what the gamer community wants, but It's hard to do that nowadays because there's so many different types of genres of games That have already been taken and they have similar and different similarities and Some similarities or whatever, but they all are different in their own way But there's some of those games that are exactly the same as others and that's where it needs to stop so, um, I had an idea for, like, a car driving game. Um, it's kind of like the BNG, or BNG, whatever, the one where you crash cars and test cars. I mean, there's, like, two other games I've seen that are like this, at, like that, but I'm pissed off because those games are only for computer, and not everybody has a computer plus not everybody knows how to work a freaking computer com compared to a console with a computer you gotta download software sometimes you might even might not even have the right computer to run the software for the games the game might glitch out in the process you know there's there's probably some a lot of crazy stuff that happens to computer gamers you know you have your your expert computer gamers that know every freaking thing about a computer i don't the only thing i know how to do on the computer is edit videos which aren't the greatest because i'm 
ghetto and they don't have a lot of money and uh, like type stories and do a few other things but I don't know how to open up a computer, rewire circuits, make my hard drive run faster, clear out data cliches that I or caches that I don't need just so I can play like bunch of mods on Grand Theft Auto and Skyrim and even combine the games like I can't do that crap you know I need to be simple just give me the console that I like to play on and let me pop my game in there and play it um you know I would love to just see a lot of really good looking computer games go on the console I don't care if the graphics suck that doesn't bother me what I want is gameplay like I would just love to have a huge massive old open world I don't care if it's flat it has cities, huge locations where I could just drive around, wreck my car, do stunts, test drive, do whatever the hell I want, you know, Delish and Derby, all kinds of crazy stuff like they do in the computer games. Like, why can't we have games like that for console? Oh yeah, because no one has the greatest idea to make a game like that because we're all stupid. <sighs> Ever since um, Throwville Off the Rails came out, that's kind of when my gaming kind of went downhill. Mainly because the PS3 had come out for about a year I think or maybe I don't know but ever since the PS3 came out be, uh, my game my gaming stuff kind of went downhill a little bit like I started not really getting intrigued by a lot of games nowadays that's the, when that started for me um the reason too is because I still had a PlayStation 2 when everybody was getting PlayStation 3s and um, recently the, the, it always happens to me it's weird I just got a PS3 last year. Yeah, actually, I've had my PS3 for a year now. God, that went by quick. And, um, the PS4 has already been out for, like, two years or three years now. And, um, yeah, so it's like I'm always behind a generation. It's ridiculous. Um, you know, it was a really great game, guys, that I would love to see come back or just see some kind of thing of it and that um it, it would have to be drone racers drone racers lego drone racers was freaking amazing that was such a great game it was so original that it made other racing games look like crap it was fantastic fantastic game um it had a few minor problems but it was a freaking awesome game and that was back in the day when lego games weren't based off stupid movies tv shows superheroes and other stupid shit it was own it was its own thing it was original like bionicle bionicle was extremely original and popular back then nowadays it's coming back it's okay but i still prefer the old stuff i mean it looks really cool but then again i'm an i'm a mature old man now you know i gotta i gotta grow up i gotta stop playing with certain things but you know what fuck that because i'm an otaku and i love playing with legos and shit um but you know what, uh, it would be great to see LEGO come out with a really, really good LEGO game. Now, LEGO Dimensions does look pretty interesting, but the thing that pisses me off is it's one of those games where you have to pour tons and tons and tons and tons of money into it just to play the damn thing. Oh, hey, you want this LEGO set? You gotta buy more shit. You know, it's it's garbage. It's just more, more ways for people. So, um, yeah, sorry about that. My phone ran out of, uh memory and had to uh save the video file so um yeah it's just you know if disney um the, the disney infinity thing's really interesting i think that's my favorite out of the three different uh collectible style game things because i think the thing with disney is theirs they're allowed to build your own world and create stuff to where i don't think lego dimensions is like too on um, that i don't know but all together, just buying all those little things for the game is just ridiculous, you know? We just pour so much money into that. It's, it's just dumb. Um, I'm sorry guys, if you like doing that stuff, I'm just not into it. It's just, I don't want to waste my money on that kind of thing. Um, I think that's just how all the industries get their money anyways, is like, Oh, well, you know, if you got this, you got this, don't blah, 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 blah. It's dumb. It's so stupid. And they don't even need to put that, probably don't even need to put that much work into that game anyway. I mean, if that game already had all that content in it, just think 
how awesome it would be to have all that stuff. But then again, they're like, oh, it's too much money. No, we can't do that. So they just take your money by doing all the little individual things. So, um, yeah, um, stupid. So, yeah, I can't, I can't talk about this topic, uh, any, any much longer. I don't want to make my video super long. So, you know what, guys, uh, if you had the same idea as me, you know, you want to go and make video games and do something really cool and creative, go do it. Um, because that's really what I'm trying to plan, like, to do with my life, is to get into the video game industry and uh, make some really good video games. Because I'm sick and tired of having crappy games, or games that I've seen before, and I'm just tired of it. The last game I played that is pretty new that I really, really enjoy um, would have to be. Hmm. You know, I don't even know. I can't even think of it right now. I'd, I'd probably say Gundam. You know what, Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur 5. Soul Calibur 5 was really, 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 really good. I have Soul Calibur 2, I haven't played it yet, I gotta get to it. There's still tons of games I haven't played yet for my PS2. Um, so, anyways, uh, you know what guys, thank you so much for watching. If you see somebody that tracks you, go talk to them. Avid is in, my friends. Woo!